Hey everyone, Scoop Science here. Earlier this week, me and a friend were discussing if I could extract zinc from a solution using electroplating, except I don't use zinc as the anode. So let's do it. Now me saying using um, something else other than zinc for the anode may be a bit confusing to some of you. But basically with electroplating, you need, if I was, this is the zinc solution, so I was trying to plate this copper foil here in zinc, I'd need to use the copper foil as the cathode, because whatever you're plating needs to be on the negative um, terminal of the um, electric current that you're applying to it, and then zinc, because it's in the solution, solid zinc has to be on the anode. But I had a look at the electrochemical series, there was manganese and then aluminium. I don't have any manganese, so I'm trying aluminium. That was underneath the zinc. Uh, so hopefully, this is, yeah, this is a will it work situation to see if I can use aluminium to plate something in zinc using a zinc solution. And then here, I have copper foil. It looks a bit like gold, but it is pure copper foil right there. Now I'm using copper as the cathode for one main reason. It's easier to see if I actually end up plating something on here. Anyway, here's my zinc solution. I'm really surprised how quick this is working. And you can see on there this is just getting coated because this is actually copper wire. Oh goodness. Alright, so now let's check it out. Look at that. So there's a definite coating on there. I just need to do one test to see whether or not this is zinc or aluminium which was coated onto this copper foil here. Now I could do, I could scrape this off, do melting point or density or something like that, but because at the moment I'm actually on a tight schedule, there's only really one thing I can do. I have here some aluminium and I did notice that zinc is actually like aluminium here is a really silver color but zinc is um, a grayer color and if I can just do a quick test like that I can see there is a very clear difference between the color of the plating here and the aluminium so I'm pretty much going to go off on a limb here and say that this was a success, it did work, it actually did coat the zinc. If any of you think that this is incorrect or anything like that, just please comment below. But right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to coat it some more. I just managed to coat that whole thing, except for a little bit there. But specifically on this side. So basically to sum it all up, I was able to extract the zinc from this solution here using electrolysis and without using z uh, zinc as the anode. So I'm pretty happy with the results there. If you did enjoy this video anyway, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to see future videos like this.